Good day, everyone. I'll be talking on how you can change your Alipay and 1688 login from your Tobao account or your phone number to your Jimmy. Now, in this video, I'll be talking more on it because most people complain sometimes about how they can't log in due to OTP program, SMS program, they don't receive SMS. But today we'll be looking on that. For you to log for you to change your login details to your Gmail, the first thing you have to do, you have to go to your Chrome browser. We want to log in a Halipay on our Chrome. This is the link you will use. My.halipay.com. That is the link you use. I will drop the link on the description box so you can click from there. Now it will take me here to like what? Let me translate. Now it has it's telling me to log in. Either I should scan code login, I should scan this one using my Alipay app, or I should use a card login. I will use this one to log in using my phone number to log in or my email. What about this thing to log in? Now I will be using this one to log in. The next thing I do is to impute. Now you impute your password. After you put your password, there's a capture here. Now you impute the capture. Most times their capture is very difficult, so you have to just be smart. Yeah, now you click login. Now I have logged into my Alipay account using my Chrome browser. Now I translate it to English. So when I translate it, I'll go to account setting on my Alipay. I click on account setting. When I click on account setting, I translate. You just have to translate some. I auto translate. Now I have click on my account setting. You see the first one. Your name will be there. The second one, mail boss. The mail boss, that's where you click. I've already had that mine, but let me teach you how you can add your storage. Now, you click on modify. Now, when you click on modify, I want to modify because I've already had that mine. Now this is here to take you to at first if you've not added your email this is here to take you to once you click on that one this is the first place it will take you to you won't see that page i just saw now once it takes you here it will tell you to impute your what your payment password for your alipay that's what you will impute so you impute your payment password you impute your payment password to alipay Now you click on next step. Now once you click on next step, it will tell you to impute your now normally your phone number should be on that place but mine because i've already added an email so they will tell you to like and you will impute your mail boss there let me use another email now let me use this email for it 
After I've added the email, I click on next step. It's like this email has already been used. Let me look for another email. Now, this is another email. Now, after after you have imputed your email, you click on next. Now, they've sent me a confirmation mail on my email. I should go and check my email for confirmation. Now, I will go and check my Gmail to confirm the mail. Now, look at, I'll click on it. Once I click on it, I'll click on this right there. This is the confirmation. Now, now I, will, I will click on it, open it on my Chrome browser. Now, I have successfully what? Added my email to my what? To my Alipay account. And I can use this email now to log in to my... 1688. I can use it to log into Tobao. I can use it to log into Timor. It's, it's on the description there. You can see. Now they they said the modification is successful. It can be used to log into the following website. I can use it to log into my Alipay. I can use it to log into my Tobao. I can use it to log into my Yitwa, my Timor, my Juzaz one, Alibaba Ali International Station, which is 1688 and Alibaba's Chinese station and Alibaba class so I can use that Gmail and my password down to log in to my world to any of those things that is how you can add your Gmail to your world to your Alipay account you can kindly subscribe to our channel for more videos and more understanding check the description box i will drop the link on how you can log into your alipay on chrome i'll drop the link there you can use that link to log in to your 1688